been a while not winning any silverware. I think uh, this one is, is going to be very important for the team. You know, uh, playing for the fans and uh, playing for the for for, 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 for the team, uh, the chairman. You know, because uh, he's, he's been supporting us all these years, and uh, obviously it's going to be nice for us if we win the trophy for him. You know, and uh, yeah, we we're going to go out and uh, play our normal football, and then yeah, do well for the team. Yeah, it's a big game. Uh, it's very exciting, you know, it's a challenge for us playing against uh, our vets. But um, I'm hoping that uh, we're going to be prepared very well, you know, because uh, the first game that we play against them in the, in the league, we didn't do well, we lost the game. But uh, coming to this game, you know, we're looking forward for it and uh, we're going to do well as a team. You know, we're coming up against, against the champions, uh, but of course we're at home and we come off a 4-1 a win. Uh, we know we didn't have the best second halves, uh, but a really uh, dominant performance in the first half. Of course, uh, if you watch the training session, all the players are excited for this big game. All the players, even the, the players that have not started, not in the squad, are really putting up the, the, their hands and really giving us a, a selection headache. Uh, so definitely a, a few questions to be able to see which players can come in and, and do the job. The intensity in training, the mood in the camp is really good, it's really high. Uh, so yeah, it's about getting the right uh, players on the pitch, not necessarily the best players on the pitch, but the best team on the pitch to be able to get the, the performance out and ultimately get the result. Yeah, we have in Policani a, a perfect uh, first time and I hope we get continue this, this, uh, on, on this game against uh, Soundowns. Yes, I hope we, we have a good game today, we, we prepared the, the team very good, we have a good training week again and then I hope we, 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 we fight for the three points. Orlando Pirates must overcome a horror home record against the champions Mamelodi Sundowns if they are to keep up uh, their outside chances of winning the season's ABSA Premiership. For Sundowns, this is an opportunity tonight to reduce the lead at the top of the table that Kaiser Chiefs are enjoying. They can bring it down to six points if they win yet ev this evening. Stolen away. Madisha is robbed by Mimela. Mimela with a shot. Well, there was uh, the possibility of Pule on the far post. Free kick delivered. High back post and more draw chance. Longa with a splendid opportunity, but where was the marking for Orlando Pirates? There's a chance for Marena. Great save, Sandy Lands. Serino. Blocked by Jele. Knocking on the door, but it's not opening up just yet. Makaringe. Mimela. Lovely ball in there for Mahango. One more. That is superbly done by the Buccaneers. Gabadino Mahango picks up where he left off in Polokwane. He has another goal. A uh, very good start of the, uh, to the game, uh, our ball circulation was really quick, uh, eliminating the Sundowns press. Uh, but of course they got back into it uh, in the middle of the first half and uh, really put us under pressure where they could have scored, uh, hit, hit the post. Uh, you know, at times our bowled up, yes, but looking more vertical, uh, not really playing long balls, but playing through the lines, but more vertical instead of uh, circulating, circulating, circulating. Uh, that is definitely what can uh, give us the spaces we need to use. The, the spaces are there, of course, uh, where they press, they go into a 4-1-3-2, leaving Charlie alone in the midfield, and that's exactly what we've got to try and exploit. Uh, um, 
we know it's second half has not been our, our, our best uh, in the last couple of games. So now it's about changing the mindset, now it's about putting in a new uh, set of uh, instructions to be able to deal with it. Uh, not only sit back and, and hold on to the lead, but uh, play smart and play really structured in terms of getting that second goal, uh, otherwise really uh, Having this unit mentality, whether we're defending, whether we're attacking, and then of course we can come through the second half uh, successful. No advantage from Kulise. Now the counter. He has a chance to see Lodge. Lodge against Lebusa. Lodge for Mahango! Disappointing pass, although Mahango still has possession. Somehow it's going to get pulled. Serino, long range shots. Ooh. Now, Pizza Mossamani a little bit earlier, not pleased about this. This is what Makaringe did. And it drew a massive round of applause from the crowd. So when he got the opportunity, he showed his uh, displeasure. Serino's done well. Serino with a shot! Goal! Surely did they cross the line! Wow! I have never seen anything like that. Four minutes of stoppage time played. He has the long ball, which Sandy Lands deals with again. More time being eaten up. Final whistle! It's all over. Orlando Pirates have won a big three points here tonight. And they've also done Kaiser Chiefs a massive favour. But it's the Buccaneers who ended a long drought at home against Mamalodi Sundowns, courtesy of a splendid goal from Gabardino Mohango. His scoring continues. Pirates of all three points. First of all, thank my God. Thank you to my, to my teammates. Thank you to the Orlando Pilots, technical pilot. Thank you to the support as well. Today was a tough game for us. It was a crucial game, but we, 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 the way we planned, we managed to, to, to get a three points. So, congrats to the team. Congrats to the support that coming numbers. Give us support. Yeah, first of all, credit must go to the team. Without my teammates, I couldn't perform like getting what I get. So, congrats to my team. It's very important for the players after um, a draining uh, a game, uh, a highly intensive game against Sundowns, to now lift themselves up and, and approach the game with the same with the same thinking. The spirit in the camp is, is really good. Um, the players are highly motivated. Of course, uh, that that happens when you get uh, two wins in a row, and especially against uh, the champions. Uh, but now. Uh, um, the players are not in the squad and the players on the fringes can see the light at the end of the tunnel that if they work hard they can get an opportunity and and that's what it's about now for all players because we need all players to be able to compete in these matches like Highlands Park. We know it's going to be a tough match. We know they, they, they come in having played seven days ago and we have to be fully fully prepared mentally to be able to approach them in the proper way. It's important we have the concentration, the, the focus on, on this team. Yeah? And then when we have 100% focus, 100% um, concentration and we have 100% the plan in the head, in the mind, then we are able to win the next three points. For, for coach and for the team it's very important and we have the chance. Yeah? We have, uh, uh, the last game was, was not so easy to play. Yeah? It was a big team in the league and now the next team is not so big, yeah? but I say this, the concentration is important. When we go back and we, make, we, we go to zero yeah? and we start a new game in the mind, in the head, then we, have, we, are, we are able to we get the three points. More than 100%, first second to the end of the game. We know three. One, two, three, one!
somber mood hangs over the Orlando Stadium in Soweto this afternoon due to the news that came through last night of the passing of Mantua Korta, the wife of not only the chairman of Orlando Pirates but the chairman of the Premier Soccer League who passed away yesterday. May his soul rest in peace. There is still business that needs to be done though at the Orlando Stadium. And Orlando Pirates looking for another valuable point and available three points as they are unbeaten in the last six matches with four victories and two draws and uh, Kabadina Mhanga with nine goals in the last seven matches has been instrumental along with his teammates in punching Orlando Pirates back up into fifth position in which they sit at the moment. And we are going to have a moment of silence for the passing of Mantua Corsa. One never wishes a family member to pass, but maybe it's fitting that Orlando Pirates have a home match against Highlands Park today, and the commemorations can start with Montua Corsa right here at the home of Orlando Pirates, at the home of the chairman of the Orlando Pirates Club, Dr. Irvin Corsa. May his soul rest in peace. Just happy Chile. It's a lovely little ball for him as well. And a great opportunity. It's more than that. It's a goal! Lots. One touch. Peters completely caught. In fact, it was a brilliant take. It happened yet. Capadini Mhango looking for the return pass. Make a pardon. Wasn't Mhango. Second make go. There's a chance for another goal. And Mhango might not have had the first touch. But he does get the second and increases his tally in the league to 12 goals as Pirates double the lead just 10 minutes in. Bogani Sam, it's a good ball as well from Sam. It's a lovely goal too, beautifully made up from Kavadidi Mhango. And he converts the opportunity that he creates. So a bigger part and it's not, it's Marco. Gavdi's the first goal of the season, I do beg your pardon. Allen's Park, who showed some good form towards half-time. But he has a great opportunity. I tell you what, Peters pulls off the save of the match. What an excellent header that was. <laughs> Quality. And Bart into the middle. Sandy lands outrageous. Goes two for two in the space of 30 seconds. Renowned goal scorer, that's proper. Nice touch in the midfield as well for Highlands Park and uh, Fortune Makaringe. Here comes Mbunjana with a shot and a cracking goal for Highlands Park. Does that open the taps a little bit? Mhango. Mhango. Oh, it's a lovely little ball. Mamela! Unlucky. Goals from Lorch, Mahango and Marco for Orlando Pirates. Consolation goal from Punjana. Pirates win this one by three goals to one. You know, the coach, uh, he did say that we need to take uh, one game at a time. And, you know, consistency is important, especially at this time of the season. Second round, we need to get as much games that we're going to win, especially at home. We need to make sure people, when they come here, they know it's the slaughterhouse. For me, I would say, ah. Uh, and you know we need supporters sometimes you know when we're down we need them to pull us up you know you can see Helen's Park was coming with long balls and wanting to score but you know as a team we worked and we knew that uh, we were leading 3-0 and we, we didn't want to concede but uh, unfortunately we did but uh, we just have to work hard especially on our second half but uh, thanks to the fans and uh, I hope they'll be happy with this week. to see what goes on behind the scenes 
Download the Orlando Pirates official app now.